My name is Dr. Jeffrey Wright. Jose Pinto. I am Paloma Garcia Casenave. The experiential methodology to develop a global mindset is key because we live in a world basically without no barriers except one, and that is culture. And at Schiller, you learn how to deal with culture for the global mindset. We work on very diverse activities in the classroom, and all of this, of course, with uh, students coming from all over the world, which favors a diverse atmosphere in the class, truly gaining a unique experience. I think developing a global mindset is fundamental for addressing current international relations issues because we live in a very complex time and all of this creates um, a lot of anxiety which we try at Chile to combat through this diversity, this very inclusive environment that welcomes students from all over the world. I think it is very important for the students to understand that uh, the economic systems are interconnected. So most likely you'll be working in an environment where the companies operate globally. So if you have sort of that global mindset and also uh, get used to the underlying dynamics in terms of how technology is being used globally so you fit in very well if you develop those mindsets at the very early stage. We worked with my students on the question of fake news. We worked with a Spanish startup named B Challenge, uh, with which the university has a, a partnership, in which we defined what misinformation, disinformation is about, and reflected collectively on the means to fight fake news, as we know have had uh, extremely detrimental effects on world politics. Sometimes I even activate, let's say, interactive connectivity to my colleagues at a working place that enables the students to interact with them. And also we arrange for visit, uh, to visit the United Nations office in Germany. And then I have also an uh, arrangement with a company called SAP. I arrange such sort of a, a contact for the students. I take them to the museums, we go to many places. And uh, two years ago, and it's something that I'm planning now, uh, we went to France as well because they need to practice French over there. So it was something very practical. They loved it and they, they, they find that studying languages is something that is essential and crucial nowadays. <laughs>